A successful weekend for Sacred Heart Soccer in the Pioneers return to campus field. Back on the mainland, fresh off the trip to Hawaii, and it's the Pioneers taking the first lead of opening night under the lights at campus field against Lafayette. That is Jennifer Mulvey getting the over-the-top pass from Jillian Pasinich and tucking it under the crossbar for a 1-0 Pioneer lead. Mulvey and Moore was the recipe for success for the Pioneers all weekend as Ashley Moore comes in off the shot from Kristen Verrett and finds the rebound to chip it home to make it 2-0 Pioneers. Lafayette would go on and score one, but the Pioneers would hold on for the win on opening night 2-1. Women's soccer wins here on opening night. A couple of veterans get the help get the W. Jen Mulvey and Ashley Moore uh, scoring. 13-14 combo, a couple of seasoned vets come in on opening night, and you get two, uh, two big goals for your team. Let's go through the first one, a kind of over-the-top chip pass sent you in, and uh, it was you one-on-one -on -one on the goalie. What happened? Um, I think it was LB who took it, and I told Jill before the uh, kickoff just to flick it to me. She flicked it to me, and I just placed it and chipped it over the goalie's head. All right, Mulvey to Moore now. You follow a rebound, uh, not giving up on the play. The first shot came from uh, the top of the box. You followed it, was laying right there. Can you take us through how uh, you put that one in and how you kind of felt going up 2 nothing at that point? Um, we knew coming out of halftime that if we put another goal in, we would deflate them. So um, that was our biggest goal. And, <laughs> um, and who was it, Kristen? Yeah. Kristen puts the ball on net. Keeper made a pretty good save, just couldn't handle it. And I just happened, happened to be in the right spot at the right time. Probably could have set this up a little better. I don't exactly have the longest arms in the world. So let's go back to <laughs> Jen. I know. Uh, to win in front of the home crowd tonight. There's almost probably 400 people here, and they were making wow. some noise yeah. tonight. So uh, sure. what, was, what does that mean? Your senior year, your last first opening home opener, what it means to you tonight? I mean, it was a good crowd, definitely. We always love coming out here. I think we've been undefeated since last year on Kansas Field, so we always have pretty good showing out here. We were pumped up before the game, and coming back from Hawaii, it was good to see that point here. The combination was now more than Mulvey. Watch Ashley Moore here get a pass from Jacqueline DeLuccia. Bend it and get it for a 1-0 Pioneer lead over the visiting Manhattan Jaspers. After a handball in the box in the second half, Mulvey would convert here on the penalty kick to give the Pioneers a 2-0 lead. And once again, just as they did Friday night, the Pioneers would hold on for a 2-1 victory after the Jaspers scored late in the second half. Two games, it was the men's turn on Sunday afternoon and would take just one. Jamal Vincent with a header off the throw in from Evan Kennedy. And an emotional and physical game, the Pioneers prevail in their home opener 1-0 over Columbia. <laughs> 